so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great and today's video i'm going to talk about how you can create a 360 rotation video of your model using the glow so without any further delay now let's get started tutorial so right now on my screen you can see we have one avatar with the hoodie basically and before starting the tutorial you need to um, take some step very seriously first of all you need to just enable your uh, thickness of your garment basically uh, right now you can see we have a thickness off and you can see that garment is looking like a paper basically there is no thickness inside this garment so before creating any kind of animation make sure you just enable that thickness option from here all right and after that what you have to do you have to just press the two and two will be uh, convert into a front view basically something like that so first of all i'm just going on my render settings and here i will just click this render and i will just click to start an interactive render so here you can see it will automatically start an interactive render yeah something like that and that's look nice by the way uh, just wait a second for a preview and if you're having any issue uh, seeing the render uh, so you need to just go to your render settings and make sure just enable the gpu from here make sure that should be on gpu not a cpu if you enable, uh, click the cpu maybe you not get a fast result all right so right now here you can see we have a that final result basically so for creating a 360 render you need to just go to your image property sections and here you have to just change the first option like image as a turntable image yeah something like that and after that you need to just uh, set the rotation angle to 360 and set the image count as a 64 you can take 180 also and 360 also but 64 is quite good and you can just duplicate these frames again and again for creating a loop basically okay so i'm taking this uh, image count as a 64 and i will just uh, enable the rotation angle to 360 and i will just change the direction to clockwise and uh, and after that i will not uh, click this save video basically because if you just click this save video so what will happen you will not get a transparent background basically right now here you can see uh, if i'm just click this transparency option so you will get a transparent uh, background and if you will just click this save video so it will automatically add the background into your uh, video basically so it is like little a uh, problem so make sure you just turn on off the video and you will get a transparent frame by frame animation and after that you can just stitch these frames into a premiere uh, somewhere else or like uh, any video editing software and you you will get your video animation all right then after that you need to just uh, change the orientation if you want to change you can just take a portrait and landscape you need to just scroll it down or first of all you need to just uh, set the your uh, render location so right now i'm just going to set the render location into a desktop and i will just create a one new folder and i will just create 360 yeah something like that so now what will happen i will just uh, take a render basically and i will just go to my render settings here and here i will just set the render time only one minute yeah, that's of nice and okay I, I will also enable the gpu supporting so what will happen when you will enable this gpu supporting so your system will take support of your gpu as well so maybe you will get a fast and uh, uh, perfect render without adding any noise basically all right so all settings are done if you want to add the any kind of lighting to scene so you can just add the lighting from here otherwise you can use the default lighting and that environment texture as well and i have already shown you the all image settings what did you what do you have to do before taking a render and uh, if you want to change any kind of uh, camera setting so you can change from here if you want to move your uh, model horizontally little bit yeah maybe vertically a little bit so you can just use these options but right now we don't want to move our uh, object anywhere it looks nice because we want this to render so after complete the all settings make sure you just go to your uh, render setting and make sure you just check the render time should be one and uh, that uh, output folder also should be selected and then you can just click this uh, pause button and after then you can just click this play button and your render will start so after that after completing the whole render you will see a uh, 360 rotation animation so right now here you can see we have a uh, one we have a uh, 64 render totals and right now first render is happening basically here you can see how far it is happening by the way 
and thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any suggestion please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys